All right, so about four days ago, I made a video on XQC where I pretty much took a look at his content and I think gave pretty good reasons about why it's shit. And I upload it and for whatever reason, the video is doing pretty bad. Like it's like 10 out of 10. I think it's like 200 views behind my 9 out of 10 video. If you make videos, you'll know what the fuck I'm talking about. Pretty much it's doing pretty dog shit compared to my other videos. And it goes on like that for two days, you know, just continues to do shit. And you know, I kind of don't think much of it. You know, shit happens. Sometimes videos don't do well. No big deal. Anyways, two days after I uploaded, I wake up early as fuck because I gotta go to school. But real quick, I check how the video is doing and it's fucking exploding. Like it starts to get like crazy views. And then I check like in third period and it's still fucking going crazy. And by the time I got home, it literally has like quadruple the views it had that morning. So I get home, disregard all homework, and I just check the comments. And I see these motherfuckers typing up literal articles about how my points are somehow invalid. Sorry, there's like a crazy echo on my mic. I think I fixed it. I turned the gain down or something. Okay, I don't know. Alright, I fixed my mic. I don't know why I did that, but pretty much, dude. I saw these comments and I'm like, there's no way I'm not making a fucking video on this. Like, dude, I wrote an essay in English today that is less lengthy than this comment. And that essay took me the whole period, so I can't imagine how long this fucking comment took this guy to write. But at least I actually get a grade for my essay. This guy gains literally nothing from writing this comment, which leads me to believe that he has no life. And I know that's a dog shit argument to make, but I don't give a fuck. What are you doing with your time? This comment is 11 paragraphs. I shit you not, 11 fucking paragraphs. That is double digits, and this is a YouTube comment section. I'm not going to read your comment because I don't have the patience to read this shit. It is too fucking long. Anyways though, while I may not be reading this comment, I'm gonna be reading and responding to some other ones. I know a lot of people are saying shit like toxic. These hate comment videos are getting repetitive, but like, honestly, I just read these comments and they just like pissed me off because these fucking XQC viewers can like easily be countered with the most basic logic. So that's what we're gonna be doing today. We're gonna be countering some of these arguments. So let's just dive into this landfill. You're saying this like anything you're doing is transformative. Which by the way, holy shit, if I'm not transformative, what the fuck is XQC? And you get bullied in school, so you became a leafy clone. Ah uh, yes, I make commentary videos where I rant about people. I must be a carbon copy of leafy. It's not like the person you're defending, XQC, is a carbon copy of every other reaction streamer that came before him. Nah, XQC invented reaction Twitch streams. That was all an original idea by XQC. But I'm unoriginal because I make commentary videos and take inspiration from Leafy. But other than all the comments calling me a Leafy clone, I keep getting these comments with weird Twitch vocabulary words such as Keck W. Honestly, man, if you use words like Keck W, whatever the fuck that even means, then honestly, just go the fuck outside. If you use terms like Pee Pee Laugh or Keck W, you spend too much time on the fucking internet. The only titties you see are in 1080p. You actually scratch that, they're in 4K because you have the best internet plan possible because that's all you're fucking on all day. There's nothing else to add. You say XQC is boring and steals content, yet this video is practically a re-upload of a video you made a whole year ago. Attention all small commentary channels, if you ever want to remake a video that you made a year ago, you are in fact stealing your own content. If there's ever a video you made where you're like, hey, that video was pretty shit, but the arguments were good, I think I'm gonna remake the video with similar arguments, but make the actual entertainment value better? If you ever want to do that, you are in fact re-uploading your own content. But, if XQC wants to sit there and let other people's videos play that he has no ownership of without adding a single thing to the content, that's okay, man. This is the most retarded YouTube comment I've ever seen in my life, hands down. Why my channel revolves around other creators and will never get popular on social media. Your second attempt to get him to see this video, you've made two videos on the guy, how sad. Now, here's what I don't understand, I can criticize whoever I want, right? And as long as they have a bad reputation, or people already hate him, people will agree with my video. They'll be like, yeah, dude, good points in this video, I agree. But the second I criticize a YouTuber that people, most people like, suddenly I'm doing it for the clout and I'm a clout chaser, and I'm only making the video because I want a response. I got this a lot on my Penguin Z Zero video because everyone already likes Moist Critical, right? He probably has the best reputation on YouTube. But when I say I don't like his content, people are like, yo, you're doing it for the views, attention, and you just want a response. Like, I don't fucking get it. How is it that when I criticize someone like... Uh, I don't know any YouTubers I made a video on that everyone hates, but if I were to make a video on JayStation, I'm not doing it for the clout then, but when I criticize a YouTuber that everyone likes, like XQC, yeah, at that point, I'm just doing it for the money. Like, I don't fucking get it. I love it how people get so salty over XQC doing literally nothing. Yeah, I explained why I don't fucking like him and how he actually does do something. He steals other people's content and essentially just re-uploads them. He makes money off of other people's videos that are not his. And the very rare times where he does make his own content, it's just him screaming at the top 
top of his lungs while literal children donate to him like, Oh my god, you're so funny. Look at this guy. He's yelling. Anyone can die in a video game and get fucking mad and start screaming. Like, I don't understand how this guy's a good content creator. Nothing you can say can convince me to like this guy's content. It fucking sucks. Is this satire? I'm confused. I know this 14-year-old with a voice more dead than an average Valorant player and humor level is the same as 2016 Leafy. Oh, that's not true. R really just didn't try to say that XQC is the worst reactor ever. My guy, XQC does 20 hour streams and reacts for a couple hours. Well, I don't want to read all this. He doesn't run his own channel. His editors upload or re-upload other people's content. I really don't want to shit on you because you sound like a normie. That's fucking Twitch vocabulary. And not really in a Twitch in general, but my guy, do some research. Also, the loud equals funny. You show two out of context clips. And that point really completes this video for me. All right, let me just explain what this guy does. For those of you who don't know, XQC's entire content is him playing video games and like failing to form a single coherent sentence. The only times where he does form a coherent sentence is when he's freaking out at a video game and screaming at the top of his lungs to make little children laugh over the internet and then once he's done doing that he's like yeah i'm fucking tired of this shit i'm just gonna go literally like let other people's videos play while adding nothing to the content because now i couldn't be fucked to actually sit down and make my own content you know i've already screamed at the top of my lungs while playing video games enough today i'm just gonna let other people's videos play while i sit there and eat lunch this is the worst like content creator he doesn't create content he steals it but this is the worst like fucking i don't know online entertainer with quotations I've ever seen, hands down. And that's not me trying to be hyperbolic or to get my point across better, over dramatic. I hate this guy more than anyone I've ever talked about before. Like, there's not even a fucking comparison. I hate this guy more than Brasso. And Brasso literally clickbaits people's death for views. Like, I genuinely think XQC is the worst content creator on the internet. Dude pulled a few clips and acts like that's his whole 24 hour stream. It is, dude. You want me to play one of its, his streams in the entirety? Fuck no, dude. I'd lose my average view duration so hard because he's so fucking boring. Watch any one of XQC's streams and tell me if it's not either him freaking out at a video game, struggling to make a full sentence, or blatantly stealing people's content. Even though I only showed a few clips, it accurately represents his whole stream. I'm not gonna sit here and let one of his whole streams play because they're fucking hours long. I'm not gonna sit here making an 8 hour video reacting to his whole stream. I'm gonna play the appropriate clips and then say what I wanna say. I don't wanna sit here and play his whole fucking stream. And if that means somehow I'm like being unfair, taking it out of context, so fucking be it dude. I'm not doing that bullshit. First minute of the video and I already know that you're quite the main audience of Aiden Ross or Speed. I'm literally not. I don't watch Speed and I don't even know who Aiden Ross is. So I don't even fucking, I don't know, man. Nice cherry picking of videos too. Dude, you could look up any XQC Rage compilation or any one of XQC's reaction videos and, and I'd still have the same fucking criticism for him. And even if I were cherry picking, I shouldn't be able to easily pick out content this fucking bad. Even if this were his worst videos or worst content, his worst content shouldn't even be this bad. This is like a whole new low for someone's worst content. Uh, sorry, it, so it sounds Sounds weird what I'm saying, and if you understand it, good for you. I'm not gonna explain this shit any further. Anyways, the rest of this guy's comment is just random shit that I don't really understand, but the last sentence is, oh, you're talking about good content, but you're talking about it over gaming clips, pretty much saying, because I use gameplay, my content's bad. That's right, I'm using gameplay, how lazy and bad of me. Dude, XQC literally sits there and lets other people's videos play, literally adding no cuts or anything. He sits there, eats food, and reacts to content. Whether you don't like that I use gameplay because it's either bad or lazy. XQC's re-uploads of other people's videos is infinitely more bad and infinitely more lazy than what I'm fucking doing. I don't care if that means I have some big ego. I don't think my content's that good, but holy shit, I know it's not as bad as XQC's. I've never heard someone sound like a Valorant player so much. Holy fuck. Yeah, dude, I'm sorry, but Valorant's for... Oh shit, I almost just said a slur. Oh fuck, dude, that's not good. Yeah, I keep getting these comments on this video like, dude, you sound like a Valorant player, and honestly, I fucking hate Valorant. Valorant. I played the game because like a lot of my friends were like, dude, you have to try it and it just kind of sucked. CSGO is better in every department and I gotta start playing CSGO again. I haven't played in a while, dude. That game used to be fun as shit. Yeah, I don't know, dude. I don't want to just talk about bullshit, like random stuff I'm into or else I'm gonna come off like a quirky fucking PNG tuber or whatever, but um, let's just move on, dude. Actually, let's not move on. I just want to add one more thing. A lot of people like who are XQC fans are saying shit like, you sound like a Valorant player. Doesn't XQC you see literally play Valorant in like a lot of streams? Yeah, a lot of these people aren't exactly geniuses, are they? Anyways, let's just move on for real this time. Anyways, the rest of these comments were pretty nice, so I appreciate it, guys. Um, I really appreciate the, uh... 
fucking support. Um, I had fun making that XQC video. I had fun making this video. And yeah, dude, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. So the video has reached eight minutes at this point, which means it is now time for me to stop stretching out this video. I'm here for your money. I made a whole $8 off of the last video, which I can't even retrieve because I don't have a bank account. But yeah, dude, um... I hope you enjoyed this, and this outro is really weird, I don't know. Peace, peace, dude, I'm fucking done.